All right, so we're making this video because you're either starting NAD or you're interested in starting NAD. So we wanna show you a little bit about uh, basically what you get and how this works. Um, NAD comes as a powder in most forms, although some pharmacies do send it unconstituted. But for this video, this requires mixing. So the directions will say to include either five or 10 milliliters of bacteriostatic water, and then the injection instructions, which you can see right there on the label. So I'm gonna have you go ahead and take both of those vials out. There you go. And then you can put those down on the counter and then pull the rest of the stuff out of the bag. You should also get supplies to reconstitute that comes in the bag. So we've got a large syringe for mixing and then they give you these helpful little booklets on subcutaneous uh, injection and your reconstitution. But for reconstitution, everybody likes a video, so that's what we're doing. Um, go ahead and pop those safety caps off the tops of those vials. Boop, there you go. Same thing. All right, so here's what we've got. We've got our NAD injection and we've got our bacteriostatic water. So what we're gonna do is take our syringe out There we go. All right, so I'm gonna have you remove the needle cap. Yep, Oop. no, twist that back on. <laughs> Just pull, straight pull, there you go. All right, and then draw five milliliters of air into that syringe. There we go, and then stick that into the water vial. There we go, all right, now flip the whole thing upside down. Yep, and now push that air in. There you go, keep going, keep going, keep going. Now let it go, and it'll give you back your fluid. There we go, and just keep pulling until you get five milliliters. You can push that air back in. Sometimes you gotta go back and forth. There you go. And then push it back right up to five. There, perfect. Awesome. Now remove that from the vial. There we go. And now you're just gonna stick that right in the top. Make sure to hold onto the vial while you do it. There we go. Stick that guy in. And go ahead and push all that into the vial. And then let some air out. There we go, perfect. Now do that again. Let some air out, and one more time. There you go, let that air come back out. There we go, and then you can pull that needle straight out. Good, and cap that sucker. All right, pick up that NAD vial there, and give it a light swirl. There you go, flip it upside down, same thing. There we go, yep and it should be fully dissolved, and now it's ready to use. So let's show the people exactly what a, uh, what is our, what does our direction say here? So we're gonna do 10 units, right? So I'm gonna have you do a 10 mil, uh, 10 unit dosage. So you'll have all these supplies in your kit. So wipe the top with alcohol. There we go, perfect. And we're gonna draw this little tiny insulin needle. We're gonna do this to 10 units. So just gonna stick that needle in, flip that guy upside down, and we're gonna pull it back just until we reach the 10. There it is, perfect. And then pull that out, and we're ready to go. So now we're ready to inject. Um, so this is pretty easy. You'll also get a subcutaneous injection guide with this. And I'll show you, very easy. So the way this works is, most common spot is to do either the love handle or pinch a little bit of belly fat. You put the needle straight in and do the injection, pull it straight out, no bleeding, no pain, easy peasy. All right, hope this helps, thank you.